plus more. And uh, I'm the Young Life Life Coach. And we're uh, going around to Lakeshore's Best and Brightest to find out how they wake up on a school morning like this. Come on along. Gonna work on my quads here a little bit. Uh, uh, hey Chase. Good morning. My name's Les Moore, and I'm the Young Life Life Coach. And I just want to see how the best and brightest of Lakeshore wake up on a a Monday morning like this. Oh yeah. How you doing before school? Great. Oh. Just a few. Oh, what do you got in bed here? Nice. No, this. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> I can see why you're a fan, though. <laughs> any uh, any tips for the viewers out there as to uh, the success of Chase Bell? I don't think so. Just to you. What do you typically have for breakfast? Nothing. <laughs> and what do you have after that? Um, nothing. You mind if we tour your workout facility here? Go ahead. Let's see what we get over here. If uh, we, it's a good thing this didn't come into play. We would have got shot here. This is the Bell Gun Collection. Five shotguns. One for every member of the family. And, if you wonder what do they shoot? Bear. This one didn't do so well. And also, they beg this fine Afghanistan hound, which also they skinned alive and now sleeps with Chase every night. Well, thanks, Chase, for this interview and a chance to spend some time with you. Uh, you probably want to head on off to school. Yeah. Except for, oh, it's Saturday. My bad. We shouldn't we, we shouldn't wake you up so early. Let's go ahead and go back to sleep. That's all right. Hey, this is Les Moore, and I'm here with uh, Lakeshore's Best and Brightest, and we're just trying to see what makes them the men and women that they are today. Gavin, yeah, good morning. How are you doing? It's good to have you here. The secret to Gavin's success is to keep a little bit of drool on the right side of your mouth at all times. Gavin, what do you usually have for breakfast on a morning like this before school? I know we're kind of springing this on you here. Uh, While you're waking up, do you mind if we just tour your room? Yeah. We got a, uh, right here. Coloma Comets football, celebrating the, the victories that they have there. What else we got here? Oh, look at this. A large picture of Elise Bancroft in your room. That's interesting. <laughs> you got anything to say about that, Gap? What else we got? <clears throat> Some controllers. Gummy bears right here. Breakfast of champions. If you ever get hungry, these are right by your bed. What else should we, what else do they, the world's largest visor collection, very nice, and highly disp, Notre Dame, right there, play like a champion today. And you wonder, how does Gavin have that amazing jump shot? Well, right here, he can shoot from his bed and make it every time, maybe 9 out of 10, let's be honest. Right. Here's his uh, awards. Right here, all the things that he's won over the course of a lifetime as an athlete. There's also this uh, press tool right here. You can make seals, like you can act like you're the president. 
and fake people out or, you know, the kings of foreign countries and press that and get laws enacted. Also, some of uh, Gavin's favorite athletes on the wall here. And you wonder, you ask yourself, how does Gavin stay so organized? Here it is right here. Monday, everything you need for the day. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. On any given Monday, let's see what he would need. He's already got his socks for Monday laid out. That's very good planning, Gavin. He's even got the weekly goals. That's great. That's good. Give any any other words of advice to uh, your fans out there? Hey, good morning. Just wanted to see how Lake Charles Finest is that how they handle their day before school. What do you guys usually have for breakfast? Hey, this is Max Gation and Colin Brushweiler. Some of, some of Lake Shore's finest folks right here. Hey, good morning, Colin. How are you doing? Hey, while you guys are kind of waking up from your wakey-wakey, uh, maybe we can tour your room a little bit. Let's find out what makes Max Max. Right here. <clears throat> Championship net right here. Kind of done himself. What else we have? World's best collection of jars. Candy. What well, makes a man a champion? What else we have in the room here? Oh, look at this. He's got a large picture of Elise Bancroft by the foot of his bed. That's weird. <laughs> Good morning. I don't know what's weirder, having the picture or the two boys sleeping together. <laughs> then right here, championship corner. Nice. Baseball, basketball, bowling. Lacrosse. Is all feeling all right? Merry Krampus. Any uh, any advice you want to give to the boys and girls out there, Max? Um. I know it's a Monday. It's before school, but it's a little early. I just want to say that. I was planning on waking up in 10 minutes anyways. Oh, you know what? Look, it is not Monday morning. It's actually Saturday. There's no way we should, these guys should be up at 10 to 8 on a Saturday. Are you hey, sure? Go ahead and go back to sleep. Good morning. How are you doing? Hey, we're just stopping by to get uh, some advice on life. Hey, yeah. I'm Les Moore, life coach, in life life coach. Just uh, in visiting. Lake Shore's best and brightest. It's a very comfortable bed you have here, right? Uh, any advice you have for the boys and girls at Lake Shore High School? Become a Lions fan. <laughs> there you go. And uh, while you're waking up, we'll tour your room here a second. See if there's any theme to the room. Let's see. Any themes that pop to your head? Maybe NFL? Mary Sanders, where's your uh, no joint bell? I like the hair. Thank you. Got Stafford well represented, way to go. What else we got in here? Krampus! He is going to, right here, RG is going to go to the Key Club dance. Verification right here. He's got his tickets already. I saw it decorated, it looks Fabulous. What else we get in the room here? Uh, the clothes that make the man right here. We'd like to go see the Lakeshore Lancers on Saturday night. Their uh, opener. What do we got down here? Oh, look at that. See that? Mm -hmm. Picture of Elise. Look at this. I just want a comparison. <clears throat> This picture is very small compared to the picture of Elise that he keeps. That's that's interesting. Can't say I'm sure that is no reflection on you. You'll always have a place in Lansbury. Where'd that come from? 
That's it. I was right down by the side of your bed. Don't so pretend like that. No. Stay in your room all the time. <clears throat> <laughs> well, thank you very much for letting us visit you this morning before school. And oh, wait a minute. That's it's odd. It's, it's, oh, oh, Saturday. Right. It's not Monday. It's a Saturday. What, do you always get up at eight on Saturday? <laughs> no. No, I don't. No, you shouldn't. That's way too early. <laughs> hey, we should let you get back to sleep. Mm. All right. Good night, Ryan. What are you doing? Look. Oh my goodness. Good morning, Curtis. Hey, I'm Les Moore. I'm with the Excellence Foundation. We're trying to, uh, I'm a life coach and I'm just trying to help you get through life. I'm wondering if you have any advice for the folks at Lakeshore High School. What time is it? Oh, it's not really. It's almost time to get up for school. Is that a lease? Wait a minute, let's see. Well, you would know. Just uh, look at that. Run your marathon workout, right? Yeah, I'm about to go run like <clears throat> five miles. 16, 17 push ups. At least a half a mile run. Mm -hmm. Part of that is a bridge. Yeah, yeah. That'd be good. Good. Well, hey, we don't want to take up any more of your time. Okay, okay, that sounds good. The crackers are yours. Thank you. So enjoy. <laughs>